bust it still? Yeah, yeah, just uh, this past week. In that newspaper article that you sent me from your grand uncle. Yeah. Uh, 1937, November 37. And they called that beer, right? I mean, the, 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 yeah. Yeah.
Well, that's quite a program, that. Oh, is. yeah. I'm just looking at the program right now. That's kind of scary. That's a lot of notes coming out. Wow. Let me check all the banjo before we start. I Coming to you from beautiful Wilkes County in the foothills of the Blue Ridge Mountains in North Carolina, we invite you to the musical world of the Kruger Brothers. Sit back, relax, and welcome to the show with your hosts, the Kruger Brothers. Hey, here we are. Whoa. <laughs> I had to get my other banjo out. So uh, thank you for tuning in again. Hello, Jody. Hey. Hello, Joel. Hello, yes. Mm -hmm. How's it going? <laughs> it's all uh, good. All comfy in my little uh, cubicle here. All good. <laughs> and the sound thank is you. good. Thank you. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. sounds uh, great. I guess. Yes. Good. Let's start with the first song. Come on. Yeah. We we'll go straight into it. Let me cue it. 
We're in the key of B for all of you out there who want to play along. <laughs> I always like that idea. Yeah. And then we, we throw in an extra measure or something to throw you off. Or play something in a totally different key. But they, they could all sing along with the, the, the middle yeah. or the bridge part yeah. there because the words are really easy for the bridge part. It's do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 right? We'll figure it out, yeah. Well, we had a few requests for this. Let's see if we can still do it. A little Beatles song. <laughs> almost. It's almost. It has something Beatlesque to it, right? Yeah. Especially the... Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Let's send this out to Oklahoma. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, that's, where that's where you played first. Absolutely. That's where yeah. we, we played yes. for Susan at Susan's house at that party, yes. remember? Yeah. Oh, yeah. With that beautiful... It's a chili. Maybe, maybe we, we should ch cook a chili one day. Uh, maybe. <laughs> one, two, three, four. <laughs> song. It's a really like a pop song. It really is. Yeah. <laughs> like that, that sign that I saw this week, you know, if you sing a pop song with a southern accent, it don't make a country. <laughs> what do we have on the program next, Dennis? Wait. Oh, tell me. Oh. Wait. I'll wait. Well, you, you saw the Blind Boys of Alabama, right? Yes, I did. Melissa and I saw them in 2002, November, in Washington, D.C. God, that must have been a great concert. It was a great concert. Mm -hmm. 
Blind Boys, Alabama. There's a great version of this of this song that I'm going to do here by uh, Sweet Honey on the Rock. I think is the name of the group. Is it in D minor? What? Yes. In C minor. Yeah, that's what I am. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, the first time I, I, I heard it was in, the, in my first grade of uh, high school. You know that one year of high school that I did with Armin Schiebler? And that was in that book, you know? He, he, that, that gymnasium. Yeah. In Zurich. And he, that's all he taught us, was, you know, when we sang in school. He, um, these uh, uh, spirituals and taught us a little bit of, you know about the history and everything and this is how this like this song was a was like a, a, a owner's manual a manual how to how to get away you know you get when you run away you get in the water so you so the dogs so can't follow you sense, mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm
that's a great song. <coughs> it really mm. is. Thank you for singing that. That was well, cool. That's really I just cool. wished I had, you know, maybe some people singing with me. <laughs> I know, I know. We should. Uh, well, no, no, no. I, maybe people at home sing with me. You know, it's a, it's always a good feeling. Yes, it is. Mm hmm. Oh. Whew, it's a heavy song. Anyway. Yeah, I know. And you have to remember all these words. Oh, the words are not that hard, really. You know. Ah. You <laughs> <laughs> better remember the color of all the robes. Well, it is a lot. Well, um, you want to play a bluegrass type song? Ooh. You want to play this? That, is a, play that, that, that is a pretty brutal. That's a pretty, pretty brutal switchover. <laughs> well, we first heard that we had a good friend Joachim Hein, who we lived in. Um, we lived in Switzerland, in the east part of Switzerland. They called Cider India because uh, they had all the apple trees over there. And so it's funny. So we moved to America, and here also the Brushy Mountains, the cider, you know, the cider country. Um, so he one day came and said, "I got an album of Jerry Garcia, you know, who's uh, he knew from the Grateful Dead." He said, "He's the best position in the world. Said, you know, there's nobody that can play he, because he can play anything." Steel guitar, electric guitar, banjo, you know, anything. And he sings great. He knows a thousand songs. He's a, just a fantastic guy. He loved Jerry Garcia. And he, and he brought that album by. And I just loved the cover already, you know, the way, the way it was drawn. And we never gave it back, didn't we? No, never did. <laughs> and he borrowed one of my Flat and Scruggs albums, you know. With never. <laughs> That he never gave it back. <laughs> so <laughs> even. <laughs> We're even. <laughs> <laughs> so let's, let's see if I can remember the words to this one. Okay. Because it's, um, you know, back in Switzerland, I was able to just sing whatever came to my mind when oh. I did this. Now, when I do it here. <laughs> People actually listen. Yeah. And they, <laughs> yeah so, so this kind of, you know, and this is really how, how Peter long. Peter is listening. listening. Oh, yeah. sure. <laughs> sure. Let's, let's, let's see. <laughs> Come in. <laughs> I'm knocking on your door, get my darling. I'm knocking on your door, please answer me. I'm trying to make you realize, my darling, that no one else was ever meant for me. Remember, dear, when you said you'll always love me. Promise me your happiness so true. Thank you. 
of me I'm trying to make you realize my darling That no one else was ever meant for me <laughs> Of course I messed it up, all right? <laughs> Why have you messed it up? I messed it up you didn't yeah. mess up anything. Oh, yes, I did. I didn't hear anything. <laughs> I played it. I heard a great, <laughs> a great, great bass solo, drum solo. Yes. Yeah, I should have changed my strings, I think. <laughs> <laughs> these, these things are sharp. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, man. This feels like I got, uh, I got glue on here. Crazy glue. Yeah. <laughs> Gorilla glue. <laughs> I should have put that stuff. Exactly. <laughs> did you tell me about this she tried to she tried to sue the company and they wouldn't have any of it because, uh, but they're gonna have to change the label now on their spray glue you know <laughs> when I was a kid you know once we were neighbor kids playing you know and one of the kids took all the bubble gum out and just stuck it right on my head <laughs> <laughs> took all after them my money you know to get it out again I think I was five years old. <laughs> I remember that. Okay, uh, the, the next tune we have for you is a little, <laughs> it's a little piece called uh, Sunday Morning on the Lake. Uh, it's on profile, uh, the, the, a solo album of mine. And it's just a little ditty, an interesting... <laughs> it has the same intro lick as Forever in a Day. You know, uh, you know, you yeah. know this? You know? But it's but actually... Is different it key. The same? It's the same? No, it's actually the same tuning, but, to, you know, higher. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's it's just the sentiment, you know, we used to live by Lake Lucerne, and uh, the mountains come straight out of the water, it seems, like rocky, and there's just woods right down to the water, and the water is greenish, you know, it looks, but it's clear. And you can drink it, it's all clean. Uh, it's a beautiful atmosphere. Uh, the Sunday morning, is the, everybody's in church, nobody's around, you can hear the church bells, you know, from far or over the water. And, and it's just it's so a beautiful atmosphere. What an atmosphere. So here's Sunday morning on the lake. What, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Reverb. <laughs> Reverb. Reverb. <laughs>
Sunday morning on the lake. It's actually, hmm, it's nice. Yeah. It's a nice. Yeah, I like playing it. What is, what is next? Oh, Paradise. Paradise. Yes. Paradise. I have to retune the other factor. I think Paradise was one of the first songwriter tunes that I learned back in the uh, 70s. Beginning 80s, yes, when I, after we were, we were street musicians still. And I can't remember if, if Jim was the one who did this or Dennis taught me this thing. I think Dennis. Mm -hmm. Because th that chorus was... That was at the time, too, when in, the, in Europe there was a big awakening of, uh, of environmental um, consciousness, you know, where, where, where people were, were realizing that things were... <laughs> yeah, things, were things are finite. Well, yeah, and things yeah. were going bad, you know. They, they, they changed some stuff around and start recycling and all sorts of things. And, and so this... Um, and since it's a song from a coal mining district, you know, it also struck a, a, we remember how it looked back at, a, at our grandparents in the, in the, in, in the Ruhrgebiet near, near Cologne and Dusseldorf, you know, with all the steel mills and all the, all the coal that was getting taken out and all those huge piles and mountains of, of dirt that, that were there and, um, and what it all did. All the houses were black. All the houses were black and everything. And there was a, there was a smell in the air. And so there was something in the song, in the song that that sort of like yes, agreed. you know. This, um, I remember our grandpa, you know, visit us, and he came down to Switzerland to visit us, and he was sitting the, uh, sitting in the evening, you know, sitting outside by a tree, and he brought some special liquor, for me, and he was already in the ninety. And he's sitting there and he's looking up. He said, "I can see the stars." Yeah. <laughs> uh, I said, "At home, I can't see the stars." Yeah. So, uh, 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 Let's do this. Let's see. It up a yes. bit. Kentucky, where my parents were born. There's a backwoods old town that's so often remembered, so many times that my memories are worn. Sometimes we would travel right down the Green River with the school Rochester Dam, where the air smelled like snakes. We'd shoot without pistols And empty pop bottles Is all we would kill Sing, Daddy, won't you take me back To Muhlenberg County By the Green River Where paradise lay I'm sorry, my son But you're too late in asking Mr. Peabody's coat trick Come hold it away Down. I'll be 
be halfway in heaven and in paradise waiting just a few miles away from wherever I am. Sing, Daddy, won't you take me back to Muhlenberg County down by the Green River where paradise lay. I'm sorry, my son, but you're too late in asking. But you too late for asking Mr. Peabody's cold trait on hold it away. I'm sorry, my son, but you too late for asking Mr. Peabody's cold trait on hold it away. I remember we recorded our first album in 1981 for CBS. And you sat in that booth, you know, way in the back. <laughs> yeah. And <laughs> when you sang that, I think, did you sing it alone? I think, you, I mean, did you play it alone on the album? I can't remember, it was really. <laughs> yeah, <I did. laughs> That's a little, it's a lifetime ago, really, you know? It is. Yeah. Yeah. We were kids, but but that know? rec that record was amazing when we yeah. we recorded that in I don't know eighty one. We recorded in eighty one. Yes, in, and, in and, two and then two days, three and days. Then, and then we <laughs> that that was at the time when there was everything. The Cold War was still in full roll and everything, and yeah. and we went and we played in the Czech Republic sometime in the nineties, um, and we played in Kupitelno. For the, for the for the venture, and somebody came and had this record signed, yes. and I hadn't seen one in 20 years. You know, it's, it, was, it was it was crazy, really crazy. Yeah, I've actually a friend of mine. You know, I have I have this Russian friend who's a a, a sound engineer, mm -hmm. and I've got also a Czech one too. A Czech <laughs> one too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Joel. Joel. It's okay. Was, okay. Was, oh, we, 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 we're gonna funny. we're gonna make you work for this. Okay. This, is, <laughs> this next one is uh, running down the mountain. Um, uh, this is just a little really banjo ditty that I that I wrote for memory when I was a kid. You know, when I heard banjo, I just wanted to hear the banjo fast. Um, so when I was, so I tried to play as fast as I could when I was a kid because I was so fascinated with the speed of the banjo. <laughs> and I got a nice, I got a nice banjo here. That that uh, it's a silver eagle that Greg and Janet made me. Actually, Greg made this carving back here. It's a beautiful banjo. I, I uh, and I set it up so it sounds a little bit like it almost would have a cowskin head that's really tight, that's scary. you know. And it's a '50s sound. <laughs> so well. this is like a memory lane <laughs> uh, for for a banjo. Let's see if I can do this. Okay. Thank you. 
Missed a note here or two. What was that Doc Watson once said when we played the Orange Blossom special? We <laughs> 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 once played the Doc we once played the Orange Blossom special for Doc Watson because Robert asked us to. And then Doc Watson listened to it and then he said, <laughs> Must be hard making a living like that. Must be hard. <laughs> 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 wow. Yeah, yeah. Oh. oh gosh. Uh, anyway. Yeah. I think the band just sounds cool. Yeah. <laughs> What's <laughs> up? Uh, oh, well, we do a country song. Hey, let me see the band. Oh. Yeah, which country? <laughs> <laughs> did we do it in C? Yeah, we, did, we did it in C, yes. We did it in C. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you so much for, for helping us uh, survive in this time with, uh, with music, playing music try to keep afloat, keep our heads over water, and uh, we look forward to see you soon again, I hope. We speak to our management, and they tell us that they're going to start booking again at one point. Mm -hmm. uh, first bookings came in, but they're all for next year, so, so we'll see. But we're trying to... I want to talk to Dale. He doesn't know about it, but I'm going to try to Dale and the town. Maybe we can do some free concerts, you know, for the Sunday afternoon where we just it's sort of set up in downtown well. because it's just a beautiful stage, the Carolina Falls stage. Yeah. And we can just set up, you know, mm -hmm. Peabody yeah, coming down and just having fun. a beautiful time, yeah. you know, and, and just play some, uh, play two, three hours, you know, just maybe yeah. some guests come by, we play some, mm -hmm. just have a beautiful Sunday um, or some days, you know, if we're in the summer. We're here anyway. Yeah, not quite anyway. as well. <laughs> uh, but, you know, NASCAR season is starting, so, <laughs> you know, it's going to be tough to get people to come out. <laughs> walk on boy. You, uh, you practice well, the wrong practice stuff. You got boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well. Now, this, uh, this is one of the first songs I learned on electric guitar for Jeff. You know, you that, did. yeah. Is that is that it's not the one you played with uh, with him at TV? You know that that clip that he sent you. I could be. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. I, I never saw the clip. <laughs> you couldn't watch it. But it was Leroy Van Dyke, I think, that they said.
The Spanish key, yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Joel, you sound great. Thank you. Thank you, Joel. Pleasure, yes. Yeah, it's great playing with you. Thank you, man. Always. Thank, Thank you, Melissa. Helping. Did what? What did you do that? Okay, I got to do that too. Is your arm still a little sore? Mm, no, but my brain somehow doesn't seem to work <laughs> this weekend. Little, it's a little fogged. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I mine is fogged. I just bra fo brain fog. Oh. Well, wasn't that a band? <laughs> No, that was Fog Hat. Fog Hat, right. Maybe my dad can Expensive, and I took it home and I took a butter knife and she caught me in the bathtub. I had chopped up this soap <laughs> trying to cut it like the Irish guy and I got in trouble for ruining the bar. Of soap. There's, there's, a, there's a piece that, that um, Ricky Skaggs wrote. <laughs> Somebody once told me the story when he ordered online Irish Spring soap and he got delivered uh, like like four thousand pounds or something. It was a what? long thing. Yes, and <laughs> no, I think, no, 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 I, no. I think he's still bathing. He's, he's still using still, it. He's today. still using it. I think up until this day. <laughs> I think he was given. That's what I heard. <laughs> you know, I'm not. I'm not spreading rumors or anything. <laughs> I'm not spreading rumors or anything. <laughs> but you know, Irish yeah, Spring. When, when, I, when I hear that, when I hear that, that sound of that word, it evokes the, the smell of it. It's, it's, it goes into the same class with uh, with Charlie. Green apple. And uh, old spice. Old spice, <laughs> definitely course. old spice. You know, <laughs> and, and, and you yes, know, the <laughs> other day I went you know, a few months a few months ago I went I went on the internets and I and, and I bought me just for memory. I, I, <laughs> Just for memory. Huh? I know I should not have done it. No. <laughs> I bought I bought a bottle of Aqua Elva. No. Oh, well, there's another one of those smells. Yeah. Yeah, let's let's let's, 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 let's play okay. one more song and all then. Right, uh, all right. Thank you, thank you Aqua so much. Velva. No, 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 no. <laughs> this is really, it's great. It brings my, so many. My cheeks are just like, thinking wow, about I'm, it. I'm, I'm 18 again. Wow, I'm 18 again. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Turn into our uh, uh, cook show tomorrow because it's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be fishy. That's that's what I can say. Okay, fishy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Melissa's not gonna try. <laughs> okay. <laughs>
box hold of my clothes. Broadcasting from Double Time Recording Studio in Wilkes County, North Carolina, thank you for watching and all your continued support. Please make sure and comment on how much you enjoyed the show and share it with your friends. Join us next time for another edition of The Musical World of the Kruger Brothers.